Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for three months from now. We're just going to see whatever comes up. What do we have for Capricorn? Three months from the date that you watch it. So, so this is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. What do we have for Capricorn, please? Oh, there it is. Ooh, a journey. Somebody is taking a journey. This could be a trip. This this could be a trip. This could be moving. This is leaving something behind, crossing a bridge, uh, going somewhere. And it looks like you're you're just, you know, you're packing your bags and you're leaving. Or somebody is coming to you. It could go vice versa. But this is moving, traveling, going someplace, literally crossing that bridge. Um, taking a journey, Capricorn. You may be taking it with somebody because of that two up at the top. Okay, so you may be, maybe you're going to meet somebody or you're moving in with somebody or you're going someplace with somebody. This could literally be a vacation or it could be literally moving. So, either way. Um, looks like you're halfway gone right now. You're probably halfway gone. You're, 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 headed, you're headed in that direction. Um, and there's no looking back by the looks of things. I think that you are being urged to uh, keep going. Uh, there's a level of indecision, though. There is, because you notice she could be looking back. She definitely could be looking back. Um, but it looks like you've come so far. You've come so far um, that you really need to keep going. My advice is to keep going. Keep going. Wherever it is that you're going, just go. You're going to be taking a journey, period. I think she's looking back here and she had this person has decided to go it's it's really really is time to go so whether it's a he or she it doesn't matter somebody is taking a journey and it's saying goodbye to something okay because it is it is um let's get a couple of these moving on what do we got for capricorn please Rooster, an arrogant, boastful person you should not cross. So you're going to be dealing with an arrogant, boastful person. By the looks of things. Somebody that uh, bugs you. This this person really bugs you. <laughs> Obviously, what's a rooster do when you're sleeping? Wakes you up too early. Gets on your nerves. Somebody you just wish would shut up. So you're going to be dealing with that person that butts their nose in. There we go. We got a couple more. Somebody that you wish would just shut their mouth. Heart, love, deep affection, and caring. So you're. This is about love, right? So I think with a two, you know, it's not a one. So I feel like this has to do with a partner. Whatever you're doing, it has to do with you're doing it with someone else. Love, deep affection, and caring. Ooh, carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. So you're definitely going to be taking a journey. There's no doubt about it. That you're taking a journey, a big one. And it has to, and this is going to, it's going to be fulfilling to you. It's definitely going to make you happy with that heart card. Beetle, good fortune. So whatever's going on, Capricorn, it looks like it's, it's going to make you very happy. But we do have a person that may be jealous or this person is poking you or they're bugging you. Maybe you're moving away from that person. Or you need to push that person out of your life. What what happens when the boot rooster gets too annoying? What do they do? You know, there's a couple of different options. I'm not going to name one of them. But they uh, get rid of it. So, that could be, you know, blocking. Selling. Uh, not sure that you can sell another person. But if whoever is bugging you, it's like... Removing that person from your space. So, something is going to be happening in three months from now. Somebody is taking a journey. 
Um, definitely. We have journey twice. So this is taking a journey. Um, I think that it, it is something that your heart wants, whatever this journey is. So what do we have? Something you've longed for, been waiting for. Mm. Three of Swords. There's a lot of regrets here. There's sadness, grieving, pain, heartache after a separation. So there's some sort of some heartache here. There is heartache. Um, crying, tears. And, and you know, when you're going to leave something behind, there's usually some sort of tears involved. Ace of Wands. Now the Ace of Wands is an exciting uh, new opportunity. It's a new vision. It says just go for it. This is an opportunity for growth. It's a very fertile time. So this is a new exciting opportunity to start fresh. Ooh, Knight of Wands happening. Look at that. That is, that is kicking it into high gear. Moving very, very fast in a new direction. So I'm not, whatever is happening, you're going to be headed in a new direction very fast. There's going to be no stopping you. No stopping you. You got this new desire and it's this new ambition, this new drive after being in a painful situation. This is the past, right? So, or what is, what is causing you to change, okay, or take action. So something is happening. It, or something hurt. It hurt really, really bad. Now you are ready, absolutely ready, ready to fly. This is this is this new ambition, this new desire to absolutely kick it, get the hell out by the looks of things. Um, <clears throat> this is the strength card. So this is finding the courage and the confidence. And it's a very healing energy. Tender, generous, kind. You may be headed towards um, a place where you can heal. This is 15. This is the devil. But look at this. This devil card in is much different. Look at the wisdom. Interesting. Somebody is leaving home. Somebody is leaving home. You notice that person is leaving home, severing ties. You notice that that is on the ground. Somebody is severing their severing ties, taking back control. That's what we have here. Freeing themselves from a situation. That is what we have here. Somebody is, is moving in the next three months. They're moving. They're just leaving it all behind. It's happening all of a sudden to very, very sudden. It's, it is. And I think that somebody was tied to a situation that they felt, um, that, they, that they allowed to control them. Somebody was in a situation that, they was, that was keeping them bound to a place that they didn't want to be. And now they're breaking free. And even though it hurts, there's a lot of regrets here as well. So somebody is... Is, has been grieving over a loss for quite some time within. But I think they were staying in this situation. I don't know if you're dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or another Capricorn. But now it's leaving that home behind. Something about the home. Because here's a home and I feel like it has to do with leaving the home behind. And you're dealing with a fire sign. And perhaps this fire sign, the love has died or something has, because of this, this right here. Something has, looks like it has died. But it's it's accepting. It is about accepting and leaving it behind. So you're going to be leaving something behind. Reluctantly. I think that you, you know, you didn't want to leave it behind, but you have to.
This is the Page of Pentacles. So this is a new opportunity. A new doorway, a new path being presented to you. You may be going through a new doorway. Starting fresh, starting from scratch. Starting at the bottom again. Somebody may be moving into a new house, moving from one home to another. This is the Four of Swords reversed. So it's the end of stagnation. It's the end of waiting. It's, it's like... Uh, there's been a time of recuperation from this painful separation. There's been a time of, of uh, healing. And I think now you're just ready. You're absolutely ready. You're ready to stand up. You're ready to get moving. You're ready to stop procrastinating. Um, somebody is, is, has uh, basically been ignore not ignoring um well that word came out choosing choosing not to break free choosing not to go choosing not to start fresh because they had to become more awakened or something like that with the four of swords reversed maybe there were some health issues that needed to be dealt with nine of coins now this is this is enjoying the finer things in life going where there is peace having being comfortable having plenty somebody is it may be maybe going their own way with this nine of pentacles starting a new business even by themselves becoming and maybe even uh, you know this could definitely be a business venture or it's a new home where you become single you go your own way um, having everything you need to survive surviving quite well we have a new opportunity uh, to become successful here where you, you will be able to prosper because this is prosperity. Some of you may be even getting some money from somebody. Could be even be an inheritance of some sort or a big payout in three months. Some sort of money. Maybe it's for sale of a house. Maybe the house sells or something to do with the house. But this is the storm is over. There's an increase in money in three months. Capricorn, there's an increase in money. So if you've been worried about money, it's going to get better. It gets better for because somebody chooses to walk away from something that uh, is dead. Okay, it's a dead end. It is. Unfortunately, it's a dead end. Because it's a dead end and they choose to find the strength and the confidence and the courage to turn their back on it and take action and go after their desires, you know, it's almost like they get a reward for doing so, for dealing with the pain of, of leaving whatever behind that was bugging them, that was causing their setbacks. This is justice. All is fair. Something's going to turn out in your favor. Some, there could be some legal things, legal issues or legal um, dealings that go in your favor. Okay? In three months with the justice upright. This is the laws of karma. This is a fair and just decision. There's a decision being made and something becoming final. This is finality. Somebody could be even getting married or signing a new contract or getting divorced. This has to do with a contract, but this is a finality. This is finding balance being in balance, getting what you deserve. If you are waiting for some sort of money or payout and you think you're not going to get it, you are. Now we only got six pentacles cut out right here. So that is the payout. Somebody's going to be getting some sort of money that they deserve. Somebody's 
something is going to turn out in your favor. You are dealing with somebody, you are dealing with somebody that hurt you very, very, very badly. Right here, the very first card. That it kept you down, that caused you a lot of fr frustrations, that made you very tired. Probably forced you to start over. Probably forced you to walk away. They walked away and now you have to wait. Forced you to take action. Maybe caused some sort of... Um, Oh, even animosity with that Knight of Wands. That Knight of Wands is very fiery. Brought out some, some feistiness inside of you, right? Caused you to, you know, maybe want to fight. They brought out the fight in you, put it that way. You know, it's almost like that. This is my fight song. This is my fight song, you know? So this is, you know, you got a lot of fight. And this is, this is a fighting for your life, right? Not that you're going to have to fight for your life, but this Four of Swords reverse. It's time to live again. So something is is changing for you where you you've really had to find that uh, drive and desire, ambition and ambition to pick yourself up and start over, and that's what you're gonna do. In three months, you're gonna be walking through a new door. By the looks of things, you're gonna be starting something new. You're gonna be starting at the bottom, starting from scratch. You're gonna be helped, given some sort of help from somebody, some sort of financial help, whether it's a legal thing, some legal battle going in your favor you know if it's a divorce or something like that there's some sort i feel like for some of you there's some sort of money coming to you that you are owed for some of you whatever is happening you're going to find the balance that you would deserve you're going to getting something that you deserve with justice upright this is good karma this is what you deserve maybe there's somebody coming in that's going to take care of you because this is tender loving care right here somebody's going this is taken care of it really is somebody could be could be coming in that and this is coming in that is really 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 going to take care of you this person um can really give you, can be equal because the six of pentacles here now and this, only six pentacles are showing that's equal give and take where there's equal reciprocation. Okay. There may be a little bit of an age difference, but it's not a big deal. Um, this is definitely going down a new path where, um, you are going to be starting fresh. But you're going to need to follow through and not give up. So in three months, uh, you're going to have this. And this could be even a sudden entrance, a sudden situation. This is very sudden. The Ace of Wands, that's always the Knight of Wands. So this is like sudden action, a sudden desire, a sudden drive, a sudden change after being uh, hurt from some sort of situation. It looks like there's there's some sort of deep sadness here over, you know, a broken heart. Somebody's heart has been broken, really, really broken. And I'm not sure if somebody, I mean, Four of Swords could be somebody passed away. It doesn't have to be. So I'm not sure what has happened, but uh, something has ended. This is a dead end. Something has ended. And it could be a job for all I, I know. Something has ended, which has caused a lot of grief, because this is grief. But now there's a, there's a, a sudden, uh, uh, what's that word? Uh, drive, right? A, a, a sudden kick in the pants or something like that, that, that springs you into action and uh, causes this journey all right so be prepared um this is this whatever is happening we have the page of cups on the bottom so the page of cups is very good news okay this is love struck a crush an admirer showing feelings happy news happy news so something really good is happening you may be falling in love with somebody new after being broken hearted by somebody or this could be news of a child or a child being born a birth so um whatever is happening it's good you maybe this is going to the hospital to have a child for some of you uh, but this is about love it's about love it's about tender loving care it's about the growth of a of you that's what it is so be prepared to uh, for things to 
uh, happen fast in three months from now. Something is going to happen where there's a change in the home. I know it has to do with the home, whether somebody is moving into your home or somebody is moving out of the home um, or, or going on a vacation, traveling somewhere. But I feel like it has to do with really leaving a home or changes in the home. Um, there could definitely be a child involved here or another child or something like that. Um, this is this is exactly getting what you deserve in a very positive manner. Whoever you are dealing with, this is a, it's a, it's positive. It's a positive change. Um, I think there's a new love, whether it's a new child that you're falling in love with. Somebody has a child, you know, and you fall in love with your child when you have that child or you or something like that. Or you're getting pregnant or somebody's getting pregnant or they're falling in love with a, a new person. Or this could even be a new job. Whatever this is, this is a new enterprise. It's a new doorway opening where, you know, <laughs> there's opportunity for something very long term with the Page of Pentacles. We have setting goals, laying new foundations, starting fresh, and getting what you deserve. And some, for some of you, this has to do with a partner that will reciprocate, or it has to do with a job where you will get paid the money that you deserve. Whatever this is, you're going to be getting what you deserve, and it's in a positive manner. Good luck.